Hello children, in this video we are going to see class 1 chapter 8 storage on a computer. So what is storage on a computer? Let us see by seeing other examples. Okay. So look here, what is this? This is an Almira, right? So the given look at the given pictures. What is this? An Almira. These are used for storing things, isn't it? They are called storage places. Why it is called storage places? Because these places are used to store certain things, isn't it? So it is it will be arranged in a perfect place and it will be closed, right? So that it is neat and you can come and get it whenever you want from the correct place. So you keep your clothes, books and toys in an almira. So it is a storage place, isn't it? Similarly, what is this? This is a school bag. You, you, why do you use a school bag? We use a school bag to carry books, isn't it? So every day you carry school bag. Your school bag is a storage place for keeping your books and notebooks, isn't it? So you will be having notebooks and books in your bag. Why? To carry to school bag, school. And similarly, what is this different box? Why do we use it? You use it to store food, potato chips or sweets in the lunch box, right? And after storing, you take this to school, isn't it? So why do we need to store? If it is kept in a, uh, see, compartments, it is having various compartments. So the food will remain safe. Each dish will remain safe in each place, isn't it? Otherwise, it, if you put everything in a single box, it will be clumsy and you, you will not feel like eating, isn't it? You cannot take the correct food out correctly so everything will be scumbled together and you will not feel like eating then what is this this is a office bag so why it is used your parents keep office papers pens piles etc in the office bag isn't it so it is called as a storage place then what is this this is a refrigerator see we are storing so many things in the refrigerator in a different place. So bottles are kept in the doors and vegetables will be kept under the vegetable box here. And all other cans, tins and these all other bowls you can place it here. And the freezer, topmost thing you will be having the freezer, you will be placing all the frozen items there. So a refrigerator is a storage place to keep fruits, vegetables and other things, eatable items, isn't it? So, uh, similarly, okay, in the same way, we have a CD and pen drive. Do you see here? These are the CDs and pen drives. We use CDs. Why do we use CDs and pen drives? We have already seen in the parts of computer, isn't it? So, uh, CDs, you, it is used to store things. You can make folders, okay? in uh, like you can store games letters stories drawings songs etc in them you can use the store data whenever you need if it is scattered here and there will you like to take the uh, uh, data and read no you cannot find it out you will be having lot of data in the computer so you cannot find it out so with the help of a cd or pen drive you can make folders in the in them and you can create for example class 1 class 2 class 3 class 4 under them you can create many folders and uh, store your things whatever you want okay so this is the storage in a computer right thank you